Welcome to Nerd Out. It is Friday, July 20-something. And uh, yeah, big weekend. It is uh, San Diego Comic-Con weekend. Well, it would be San Diego Comic-Con weekend, but you know, we're, uh, we're doing the best we can. Uh, lots of uh, companies are revealing some new toys, and that's very exciting. I've seen already a few things that I'm pretty into. But uh, let's show you what, uh, what's new at Nerd Out that I'm into. So let's, uh, let's go around and take a look. Uh, we'll start right these. These just came in. These are the boys action figures by NECA. If you are over the age of 18 and haven't seen the boys yet, you're missing out because it's fantastic. Um, I shouldn't say really over the age of 18. If oops, if you're uh, into this sort of sort of story, it's um, it's fantastic. I love it. These figures are pretty cool. Um, Homelander and Starlight. Yeah. So these just came in, and that's pretty exciting. Uh, let's see. Speaking of new, uh, yeah. Look at this. Snake Eyes. This this weekend, uh, Snake Eyes comes out, and I'm not gonna lie, I am a bit concerned. Lots of uh, questionable reviews. Uh, with that said, I'm gonna go see it Monday. Don't spoil it for me. I'm still gonna go see it. I am very um, uh, and I, I really very much indebted to Snake Eyes and Storm Shadow. Uh, whether this movie is any good or not, it really doesn't matter because these figures are fantastic, and I have them in stock. They are really good. Uh, maybe a little bit more color could have been on that storm shadow but this isn't really about randy's opinions this is about what's new anyways uh the snake eyes is fantastic they're both really really great so those just came in uh get them while they last let's see what else we have here oh this is cool a lot of people have been asking for a lot of new uh naruto stuff and i got this naruto um sage mode figure that's in in stock very cool let's see oh did I get, I got these new steel bone mechs. These are the 125th scale. These are fantastic. The detail and articulation on these are just insane. So if you haven't checked them out yet, I, I highly, highly recommend them. Let's come around here. I think it's like a pretty... Oh yeah, speaking of uh, cool, this is the 118th scale new Battle for the Stars mech. Uh, I haven't had a chance to open one yet. But uh, these are fantastic. I, I think I'm going to have to open one. I opened this one and I absolutely love it. So it's just really been a matter of time to open this guy. And this one's box is even bigger, if you can believe that. That's insane. So I'm uh, big on that. That's new. Let's see what else we got. Um, hold on. I got to use my brain. Let's see. Oh, I put out a lot of new 25th anniversary uh, Pursuit of Cobra G.I. Joes. So the G.I. Joe section is fully, fully stocked. Some of the best ones, too. Um, I, I really love Pursuit of Cobra. This is one of my favorite lines ever. And that, that beachhead is great. I love this snow job. He comes with all the gear. That's probably my favorite post uh, Amer Real American Hero toy line. And uh, I have them all. I love them all. And uh, you should have them as well. So lots of lots of 25th anniversary G.I. Joe stuff, including those crazy assault on Cobra sets up there. If you've seen those before, those are crazy. All right. And I also put out a bunch of new vintage Joes. Lots of good stuff in there. Where are they? They're all in there. But a uh, bunch of new vintage stuff. Let's see. Oh, yeah. And this awesome. Who, who didn't have this collector's case? I did not. But if... I think everyone else did. But what a classic. It's even got the inserts. Uh, this is sweet. You can rock your collection. Bring it to your friend's house when you guys are, are playing. And uh, you can bring uh, some of your favorite Joes. And that would be awesome. Let's swing by here and see what else I have put out. Uh, refilled some Transformers as always. But I can always use more. Oh, this is fantastic. Check this out. Hot Toys Bank Robber Joker. Uh, I don't know what to say about Hot Toys. They are truly, undoubtedly, the best looking action figures ever made. Um, for I mean, they're just beautiful. They're like pieces of art. So there's Joker, and uh, that's serious. That's awesome. He comes with a ton of accessories. Wow, he's just so cool. I also have this amazing other Hot Toys, which I don't have open, so you're just going to have to... Trust me when I say it's awesome. It's the uh, Batman Armory. It's Bruce Wayne and uh, Alfred. So anyone who was craving for an Alfred action figure, here's your moment. Uh, but it is cool. It comes with the armory and it comes with uh, like 
the bat suit and everything so put that on your list it's a it's a pricey piece but you know what i'm saying it's it's sweet uh let's see let's go around here is there anything else i put a bunch of other cool stuff in the case but who remembers what it is now same thing here lots of new stuff i put in oh i uh i restocked the hot wheels selection so if you just want a little die cast fix got a bunch of new hot wheels i put out there that's pretty exciting uh refilled some of the comic books and let's see anything new here i know i got something i'll be um i'll be restocking the mortal kombat figures possibly tuesday maybe even before i'm getting uh that wave uh the last wave back in stock so for those of you who missed it i will have them back in stock again and that's fantastic news oh these are great i forgot to talk about these the uh reaction star trek figures next generation uh it's been like god what 1990s so it's been almost like two decades since we've had like star trek next generation figures really i mean well, i guess we we had some but look at that wesley Wesley does the con so you can get him signed. This is the best one, but it's because it's the Borg. I mean, the Borg is like the coolest Star Trek villain. I'm going to get a lot of hate and argument on that, but, you know, it's my opinion. Uh, let's see. There was other, one other one. Oh, yeah, and then you could get some Whoopi Goldberg action. Uh, these are fantastic. Um, Star Trek in the 90s was just, like, everywhere. Those Playmates toys were, like, a big deal. And uh, it's been a while since we had Star Trek toys, so here's your chance. Get some Star Trek toys. What else did I get? Uh, let's, let me think of what... Oh, yeah, here, this is fantastic. The Jon Stewart Green Lantern in stock. That's fantastic. I got a bunch of loose Marvel Legends I just restocked. And uh, some loose, like, DC Direct figures. I put some new ones out there. That's great. And uh, let's see, did I miss anything? Oh, yeah, I got the... The Funko Pop Baroness for all those uh, pop heads. I don't know what you guys call yourselves, but uh, we'll call them pop heads. Anyways, uh, Nerd Out is at 8106 West Nine Mile in Oak Park, Michigan, right on the edge of Ferndale. I am always buying, selling, and trading. And uh, yeah, I love buy, selling, and trading. So bring some stuff in or whatever, and we'll make something work. And uh, open 11 to 7 Friday, 11 to 7 on Saturday, 12 to 5 on Sunday, and you guys know the drill. So uh, until next time, nerd out.